does this. In today's video, I'm going to be unboxing the One Company Quick Ball. This is one of many of the premium electronic replica display Pokeballs. So without further ado, to be a do, let's get it. All right, guys, here we are. Here we have it. The One Company Quick Ball electronic replica. Here's the front of the box. The left side with the presentation case. There's a presentation case and the, the Pokeball displayed inside. There's a top. And here is the back. Quick Ball electronic replica. Display grade electronic replica. Highly accurate. Metal shell with fine detail. Premium painted finish. Advanced touch and proximity sensing technology. Gorgeous lift to display presentation case with touch sensing illumination. Individually numbered and batteries included. Alright guys, let's get this thing unboxed. Here's the top and the opening. You get a manual. Let's leave it on the side. And then you get some styrofoam on the inside. And if this styrofoam. Oh, the pop the poker was actually stuck on the top one. There we go. And here is the presentation case, and here's the poker. So let's start with the presentation case. Take off the plastic. Alright, so here's the presentation case, guys. Something straight off the bat that I think they've done different. Just put like a sticker on the flap. I don't remember them doing that for the older ones, so there might be something new. Here's the top. Here's the bottom with the pull tab for the battery. Here's the individual number. You pull the tab, it activates the battery. And that is for the LED inside. Go. So I'm gonna peel this, and then when you tap on the plat, it changes color. So we got white. There's red. There's green. There's yellow. That's blue. And there's a purple slash pink. And then you got a light blue or cyan. And that's the presentation case. Um, actually, let me just leave it open. So let's, let's leave it on cyan. Here is the quick ball. Oh yeah, that looks good. Oh yeah, that looks good. That's a nice premium display replica Pokeball right there. And you pull the tab. That activates the battery for the lights on the Pokeball itself. So, hold this for like a second or two. There you go. And that's lights activated. So this is proximity sensing as well. So, when you move your hand. There you go. I don't know why. It's, my other hand's on it and it's not lighting up. It's barely lighting up. You might not be able to see it. But, and then, as you bring it closer, it lights up even more. There you go. And that's the Pokeball. So I'm going to show you how to display it outside of the display case. You're going to need a screwdriver for this. Alright, so once you have your screwdriver, here's the screw at the bottom of the case. Wow, this is actually scratched up. What the... How did it come out like that? This is brand new as well. From the Pokemon Center itself. Alright, so... There you go, it's unscrewed. And then you just should just come out. Yep, there you go. There's a top. There's the batteries in there. There's, there's the display ring to display the Pokeball outside. So let's use the screwdriver to pop it out. There you go, and there's the display ring. So you have two ways of displaying it. So you can display it inside the presentation case, like so. I'll show you a better close-up shot in the glam shot. There's it inside the presentation case. Or you can display it on top of the presentation case like so. 
put the ring on top and there you go and this is where i can show you better the touch sensing proximity so there you go it's not lighting up right now and then as you get closer you might just be able to see it like it's brighter and brighter and then when you touch it it lights up at the brightest it can Pokeball also has like a catch sort of um function, lighting function, where if you press the button, then either turn green or red, I believe it's a 50-50% chance, I'm not too sure. But let me just show you. So I'll click it once. It's gonna flash a couple of times. So there's the green. Don't know how well that's gonna show up. Let me just I think the extra lighting might not help, oh, but there we go. Okay, so Yep, so there's a the green. I'm not too, too sure how that's going to show up. That's green. And there's the red. There you go. So there's the catch slash non-catch function of the Pokeball if you click it in. So the presentation case itself is made of like a plastic. It's quite flimsy to be honest, like when you open it, quite flimsy. At this price point, I would like to, like I could always say, and probably like, if you watched all of my other videos, link in the description down below, guys. It would be nice to have a more premium presentation case, but probably up the cost of it a bit more. But this is what we get, probably because of the RGB and the LEDs inside, it costs as much as it does as well. That's presentation case. It's not too bad for what it is, to be honest. And then the Pokeball itself. This thing is heavy. This thing has some weight to it and it's made of metal. It's actually premium. Don't know how well that's gonna pick up on the mic. But yeah, this thing is heavy. If you throw this thing, you're definitely gonna break something. The advice not to throw it at anyone or something. It'll definitely break something. But yeah, that um the Pokeballs are made of premium quality. I love how they're made. So as of now, the one company has made a Pokeball. A great ball, an ultra ball, a, a premier ball, a dust ball, a limited edition master ball, and then a special edition master ball. The limited edition is limited to 5,000, I believe, in the US. It was made in the US for the US. And then there's a special edition one that was made for UK Pokemon Center, which is special edition. It's not limited to a certain number. And then they made a hill ball. Friendship ball, a quick ball, they have a cherished ball and a love ball out now, which I'm gonna get around to unboxing soon. So subscribe for that, guys. But yeah, that's their lineup of their current one company electronic replica display Pokeballs. I have the cherished ball, I will be unboxing that very soon. Stay tuned for that video, guys. But yeah, this was the one company quick ball. If you enjoyed the video, if you stuck with me to the end, I'd appreciate if you could leave a like, subscribe. Turn notifications on for more and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.